Hey friends, welcome back to Cleaning Therapy. My name is Jenny, if you're new here, and today we will be cleaning up my kitchen and decorating it for fall. So I hope you're ready for some cozy fall inspiration as well as cleaning motivation. And today's video is a little bit special because it's in collaboration with three of my very best friends here on YouTube. So this is also a giveaway video, and we'd love to give back to you, our subscribers, in appreciation for your support. So this giveaway will be for a $100 Amazon gift card, and in in order to enter the giveaway, we will all be placing blackbirds in our videos. So if you just comment down below where you saw the blackbirds on my video, and then in my description box, we made it easy for you, and there'll be a playlist of all of our videos that you can just click one link and watch all of the videos. Comment on every video where you saw the blackbirds, and you'll be entered to win the $100 Amazon gift card. So you must be subscribed. This is a subscriber giveaway. But other than that, just make sure to comment on each of our videos. The blackbirds symbolize our friendship and the way that we've helped each other and supported each other on this journey. So we just wanted to celebrate that with you guys with a giveaway. So without further ado, let's get to cleaning and decorating. Okay, so I'll start by just getting this dishwasher unloaded and getting these dishes in the sink loaded up. Leave an emoji in the comments if you're cleaning with me today or just relaxing, maybe enjoying a nice cup of coffee or hot tea and just getting some cleaning and decorating inspiration ready for the next time that you're working in your home. So thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you so much. If you're new here, my name is Jenny and I live in Southern Louisiana with my family and I love to provide cleaning, motivation, decorating inspiration, as well as decluttering and organizing here on my channel. And I did start my channel about four years ago when I was dealing with some mental health issues, anxiety and depression, and it was just so helpful for me to get up, get moving, and get my house in order. It's always been therapy for me, and even though I don't always love doing it, it always makes me feel better. And I really hope that when you watch my videos, you feel better too. So please subscribe if you're new, if you like what you see so far. I would love to have you here as part of my YouTube family. And if you're coming over from Robin's or Michelle's or Ashley's channels, thank you so much for being here. I hope you feel welcome, and I hope you get some good cleaning and decorating inspiration. I really appreciate you. I'd love to meet you in the comments, so please say hello. I'm starting in this little corner cabinet here and I'll put up these little cookbooks up at the top and then I also have this little copper pot that I got while thrifting at the Daphne Antique Mall. And then down here I have this crock with some rolling pins and then I wanted to add this little tin cake stand with some muted greenery inside. I did originally have a pumpkin to put on top, but I couldn't find it at the moment. I think my four-year-old's been playing with them. But I also wanted to add these saucers and this cute little pumpkin creamer that is from Hobby Lobby. And that will complete this little accent cabinet here in the kitchen. And I did forget to load up the dishwasher when I was finished unloading it, so I still have that to do as well. So now I'm gonna take a quick second and just get these dishes loaded up. I think I was getting a little ahead of myself and I was just a little too excited to decorate. But I wanna get these all in so that they can be running and I'll go ahead and give my sink a really good scrubbing as well. Let me know in the comments what you've been doing in your home lately, what projects you've been working on, and what cleaning you've been doing or decorating, organizing, anything like that. I would love to know. And I love to encourage you guys just like you encouraged me on here. It really, really makes a difference. So thank you. And let me know how your decorating is coming along. And if you're finished decorating or if you still have a little more to go. We are a little behind in our decorating this year. We were all sick this month for most of the month. And so I'm definitely playing catch up over here, trying to get the rest of my house decorated. I 
I tried to pull down my shade a little bit so that the sun wasn't coming down so harshly on this sink so that you could see a little bit of what I was doing, but I'm just spraying down the sink real quick, getting all the food out, and then I have the Mrs. Myers Cream Cleanser in the Lemon Verbena scent and this little round scrubber, and I'll go to work and get this sink scrubbed out. All of my fall decorations are in the dining room right now, so I'll be bringing those in and getting everything set out. And then after I'm done with this video, I will have a dining room deep clean video and then we will decorate the dining room as well. So I'm so excited for that. I hope you'll stay tuned for the rest of my fall decorating and then we can move into some more content. I still have to decorate the dining room and the front porch and also our bathroom. So I'm very excited to bring that to you here shortly. As I was cleaning the sink, I noticed that this window wasn't very clean, so I went and got some glass cleaner and decided to clean this window as well as the windowsill. It's definitely a slippery slope when you start cleaning in the kitchen, and I'll start seeing so many things that need to be cleaned, and it ends up always taking much longer than I'd like it to, So, but it's better to have it clean and have a nice clean slate for decorating. I wanted to let you guys know that I'm on Instagram at Jenny Teal. I'd love for you to come find me over there so that we can be friends and message each other. And then I also have a Cleaning Therapy Facebook page that you can join and follow for behind the scenes and my latest videos and anything else. I also have some cleaning checklists that you might find helpful. So please join me over on Instagram and Facebook. I would love to connect with you over there. Okay, so now I'm just gonna give all of my counters a really good cleaning before we put up decorations. I'm using the Mrs. Myers all-purpose spray in the apple cider scent and a microfiber cloth. Here by the stand mixer, I'll just add this cute white pitcher with some wheat stems inside. It's kind of shaped like a pumpkin, which I think is perfect for fall decorating. And then this little mortar and pestle as well, that was from TJ Maxx. Then over here at the very end of the counter, I just have a couple of cookbooks and this glass pumpkin on top, and I'll fill that with some candy for the kids. And then over here by the lamp, I made my own little potpourri by putting some pine cones and dried oranges in a little gray bowl. So that will complete that tray. And it's very simple, but I really like simple decorating lately. It's much easier to clean around and it's just enough fall touches in my home to create a nice atmosphere. Over here by the window, I have another tall pitcher with some fall florals this time in a nice pop of color for the season. I love all the colors on these leaves. There's browns, oranges, yellows. I just think it's the perfect little fall touch. And then to top it off, we have the Bath & Body Works candle, pumpkin pecan waffles, which is definitely a classic for the kitchen. Last thing I want to add are these cute little black birds and I'll go ahead and put these in my kitchen window. Now that my kitchen is all decorated and cleaned, I'll go ahead and get these floors swept. These floors were so dirty on this day 
And every time we change the trash, things get on here and from all the cooking and everything, just I feel like kitchen floors just get so dirty and this day was certainly no exception. And I'll finish off here by using my light and easy steam mop and this is the method floor cleaner in the spearmint sage and I love the way this smells and the steam feature on this mop just does such a good job at really really deep cleaning these floors so I was really glad to get these floors good and clean today if you're looking for a good affordable steam mop I always keep this one in my quick links and it's called the Light and Easy Steam Mop, and it's very affordable, it's lightweight, and it just does a really great job of steam cleaning and deep cleaning. And you actually don't even need to use any solution when you clean with it. I just like to because I like the way it smells, but you can just clean with water and it does a wonderful job. Here's a little quick tour of my kitchen all decorated for fall. I hope you like it as much as I do. You'll have to let me know in the comments, but I think it's just the right amount of fall decor to enjoy this season. Thank you so much for being here today. I hope that you'll visit my description box and click on the playlist and visit all of my friends YouTube videos and then search for those blackbirds in their videos subscribe to our channels leave a comment and enter to win the $100 Amazon gift card we will be announcing the winner next Sunday you're gonna love their channels they are just such inspiring and wonderful ladies I love them so much and I know you're gonna love them just as much as I do and you're gonna love the content that they provide on YouTube Friends, thank you so much for joining me today for this fall clean and decorate in the kitchen. And remember, no matter what you're going through in life, you can always come over to my channel and clean your way to calm with me. I love you, friends.